when the IBEW found out that the gateway to learning school had a subpar Wi-Fi infrastructure, well, they sprung into action, a deed certainly worthy of hometown hero status. Let's have a look. When the stay-at-home order started coming into place in March, we had 107 participants here at Gateway to Learning, adults with intellectual disabilities that we were teaching life lessons and job skills to. And we've been closed until September 8th. So one of the greatest challenges we faced was when we came back, we knew not every person could come back into our programs. So we needed to find a way. This building was built in 1986. The internet was not even thought of during that time, especially for adults with disabilities for its use. So we had a need. We knew we needed to do those online meetings and just continue to provide socializing opportunities while also teaching opportunities online. And thanks to Powering Chicago, they stepped up in a major way and got that for us. We can now provide learning and socialization for adults with disabilities. When we were first confronted with the ask, uh, Jameson and Bowers, one of our Powering Chicago partners, was eager to be put the task to provide them with their service. COVID-19 has affected every industry negatively. Individuals with intellectual and developmental challenges are especially susceptible to COVID-19 and its adverse effects. And so it was so important for us to get involved to provide our electrical expertise at whatever level that we could. It was amazing. They came in on a Tuesday, they were done by Friday. They dedicated not just the resources, but the time and the talent of their individuals to come in and work. And so they had anywhere from two to five people at one time in here running hundreds and hundreds of feet of, of cord for us to have internet, to have really, it's to provide access to the world for our participants. And that's the amazing part. Let's shake it all out. We're taking care of our wellness. So before Powering Chicago came in and fixed the internet at Gateway, it was nearly impossible to get online here. And now with e-learning being an essential, we are so grateful because the quality of online instruction is directly linked to quality, speed, and reliability of the internet. And now everyone can fully participate from home. And everyone at Gateway, we really do consider Powering Chicago to be heroes, and we're very grateful. What I see is that it is our responsibility to give back to the community. And that's one of the things that I love about Park Chicago, is that because we are from the community, we are just like them. When they look at us, they see us. Although we might be able to perform the electrical work and that may seem heroic to them, it is just what we were trained to do. And we have no problem or no issue with giving back to our community. Of 107 people, we're down to 25, so not everybody can come back due to risk factors, not everybody's willing to come back, but they can learn online and that's where we're driving next.